Thank you. Amphi, thank you for the 68 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Wow. That is actually taking longer than I thought. Streamer is not prepared! Ooh, I wonder I wonder what is going on that is clogging up Steam servers. Uh let's quickly change over to just checking while we wait. Egg. Oh right, the summer sale started, didn't it? Oh dear. Shark jumping wars, thank you for the hundred bits. I fucked up then. <laughs> Should have downloaded this earlier. Is it seemed like 20% off? That's pretty good. Stop leaving us in suspense. It's not really suspense. <laughs> it is it is not a it's not a big deal. I hunger for nourishment. Wow. Ah. I think every pet owner says, oh, big stretch. Big stretch. I say big stretch to my dogs, and I say big stretch to my parents. You can only pick one. Would you have burger or pizza? Let me turn that down for now, because I don't know how loud it's going to be. And I'll force it over to the other course. What could this sound be, chat? What could it be? Bloodborne. Yes, you got it in one. Good job. <laughs> I'm hoping it's good. Uh, I was planning on finally playing Cyberpunk when the new update drops, because apparently it includes a lot of stuff that makes it closer to the game that it should have been all along. Yeah, I've heard really good things, and it looked exciting. In a chill kind of way. <laughs> I like my graphics settings options here. <laughs> up and go, yeah, sushi, and then hang up. I still have plans to play Final Fantasy 16, and I still have plans to play Pikmin 2, but there are so many good games coming out at the moment that it is actually a little bit overwhelming trying to get everything that I want to play done. <laughs> but 
Do I have plans to finish Tears of the Kingdom? Of course, yes. I wouldn't ditch it after so many hours now. Come has been thwarted a little bit because of the whole like uh, EC reinstall. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. <laughs> Yuki, thank you for giving the gift of us up to Safikens. Thank you, thank you. So where's the sushi at? Don't wash yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. <gasps> Is this a sushi roguelike? Sekiro and Elden Ring fucked my hands. So. Which means this could be an incredible business opportunity. What kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go on, go ahead and go on in. I don't have a good feeling about this. A sushi bar by the blue hole. Nice form. All right, how about stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With left trigger, you can move quickly. This speeds up oxygen consumption. Oh, God. All right. <gasps> Pretty! I need to turn some of the audio down, I think. Looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Now, practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, then dive knife. Use the B key to knife fish. Fish! Now, shut up. <laughs> you fucked fish. <laughs> Is this how people fish? They go down in diving suits and engage the fish in knife combat? <laughs> well done, smooth and quick. And finally, I haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? The harpoon? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then, hmm. Looks like you'll need some practice. Try using the harpoon to catch three fish. I am with A and fire with right trigger. Now try it out yourself. Cha! <laughs> That's amazing. Come here, Dory. No! <gasps> no. Come here. Look them up. I think that should get you back on track in no time. Alright, come back up to the boat. Now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? For sure, that soft meat with oily rice? Oh man, that's such the, just the best. Well, listen up, I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but the one skill that I can guarantee is... But has one skill I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. The sushi sold here is made from fresh, fi fresh, fresh fish caught in the blue hole where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people will just go nuts for it? Yum! I'm already craving it! Haha, <laughs> I bet. So, why don't you join me on this awesome venture as well? What do you say? Man, I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Don't- nothing to worry about. The restaurant is all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? What happens if I say no? I don't really have any money on me. I don't think I can pay. Ah, that reminds me. I just remembered that a while ago you broke my underwater drone. The repair cost was about 500 gold, but I didn't charge you for it. Um, it broke after five seconds of use. It was broken already, wasn't it? What do you mean? It was totally fine. 
Well, okay, so what should I do? It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Wait, I said no! <laughs> I think I just got blackmailed. Hey, Bancho, are we all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. I love his portrait. Hold on. Look, look at it. Look at this guy. <laughs> it's ready just in time. Oh, it's already finished? You? Oh, you're the fisherman Cobra was talking about. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. All right. Anyway, nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. So, do you like sushi? I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy, just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Mmm, just as mediocre as I expected. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish, just like you. How empty a life is... How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer? Leo's face. <laughs> My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone mm, without any. What? 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 <laughs> huh. Well, that sucks. An, an earthquake? The interior is really quite a mess. It looks like we'll have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spend all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair cost through doing business in this state. <laughs> in the end, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch several more fish first. Oh, and the restaurant is going to be open only in the evening. Won't that decrease sales? I think we should invite customers without... You think we should just invite ad, uh, invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? It's a chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. It seems Banjo is really passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. I haven't seen Bancho so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. The incident? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. Well, anyway, we need more ingredients, so go catch some fish. <laughs> okay. I dive. You can't cook any more dishes once the wasabi runs out. <laughs> but I don't like wasabi. <gasps> Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Wood. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. <gasps> Can I murder a seahorse? Nope. Do we do? We swim, swim, swim. A cheap Japanese sword! <laughs> okay. Okay, now I have a, I have I have a sword. Wasabi is very spicy, which is why I don't really care for it. <gasps> oh, oh, oh! Kill! Ow! Yeah, boy. Red lionfish. Oh, I just realized I'm way too deep. I think I'm losing oxygen quickly because of I'm so deep. I guess I gotta upgrade my gear. Ooh, can I murder this? I forget, how do I fire this? I forgot already. Oh, I cannot murder that. Game's hard, dude. Fuck! 
I'm being denied by these fish. Yeah. I don't know, can I surface and get air and then come back down? Easy. Be fine. Nice, nice. I don't know if you guys saw, but he gave me a thumbs up. Extra fish, though. What's this? Is it a delicious neurotoxin, though? Yoink! Oh! Fish too strong! Jesus, that's gonna do it in my hands eventually. Ooh, oxygen! Nice! Okay, that's good to know. Oh! Can I murder this? No. Good lord. What happened to my knife? Or my, my my sword? Do I lose my sword when I when I surface? Did he Did he steal my mall sword? What the fuck? Rude. I guess because that's the roguelike component, right? Lagoon Triggerfish. Underwater Scooter. <laughs> what? Left trigger to... Whee! That's awesome. Oh. Sha! Yeah, I'm sorry the taps are probably really loud. <laughs> Oh, I'm overweight. Boost! <laughs> Looks like you caught quite a few. At this rate, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. My my, would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? Wrap up your day and get things ready at Bancho Sushi. You'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get ingredients ready before the dinner hours start. Huh, okay. But wait, why am I responsible for anything to do with the restaurant? You said I wouldn't be, you dick! How are the preparations coming along? I think we're mostly set. That's good, here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. I feel like I'm being scammed a little bit. What? I don't understand. 
Cobra told me that there would be somebody to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do was cook. And who else is there for that but you? Well, I've never worked at a restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. What? Open the ingredients. Here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all other materials you have. Oh god. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Register actual items to the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier, so try registering that to the menu. Oh. Red lionfish sushi. Let's poison everybody. That probably wasn't that hard. Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you'll have to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. You can enhance the flavor of the dishes, so try it out when you have enough ingredients. Fill out the menu as much as you can. Oh, I gotta make my my rest or my menu better. Okay. Remaining menu will be discarded when the restaurant closes. Oh, so I actually have to be careful not to overfill because I won't have enough customers. Okay. I don't know how many will pass though. So. How long are you going to stand there talking? Oh. Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Have you perhaps poured green tea before? Face Fox, thank you for the ten months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Is it any good? I'm having fun now. I haven't played very much, so we will see as the game goes. No, only soft drinks, I think. I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Oh, right, right stick to pour green tea just the right amount. Oh! Perfect! <laughs> Customers who drink green tea of good or higher grade will pay more. Okay. As expected, Banjo's green tea is quite something. That tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? Demanding as always, why don't you try serving him some food while you're at it? Come over to where I am and take this food. You can dash when serving food. Use left trigger to move quickly. Don't forget to watch your stamina. There you go. You sent the package last week, you say? What in the world? Let me check on that. Wait, what? No! The food! The so word didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. No, I'll eat it! It seems like such a waste to throw it away. Bancho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Well, okay. Everything looks about ready. I haven't cooked for customers in a while. I'm kind of nervous. Don't forget to press Y after filling the menu for business to begin. I just noticed the fucking sign that says at dink low. <laughs> Okay. I forgot how to run. one of those games that's like super Moorish, you know where like you just kind of press pick up and play, and play it for a little bit on the go 
And it's just like super fun to just like come back to it every now and again. And be an efficient sushi chef and diver. Lovely stuff. Close for the day. I think I made a negative profit because I put too much out on the menu. <gasps> yeah, switch your Steam Deck game. This would be really fun for it. I'm, I'm enjoying it a lot. Many lovely fish! My work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. You try a little harder next time. Wait, didn't I get like four and a half stars? <laughs> I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. A man should not feel gratification from simple compliments. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. In any case, a toast to the opening of Banjo Sushi. Question mark. <gasps> Kappa. Oh. Get crackened. Who's been diving around here? Okay. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> uh, I was expecting a more professional looking guy. Okay. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Okay. Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? Okay. I'm Ellie. Oh, here you go. This is what Ellie looks like. I study biology at the local graduate school. Okay. I've come out to investigate after reports from of anomalies in the area. Okay. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I'd like to study the ecology of the blue, the blue hole, so get me some agar and red starfish first. I don't think it's a good idea for just one of each, so get me two. Your tone makes me want to refuse. Hmm, I got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. A re reward? Well, I wasn't refusing, I was just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry, don't dally. <laughs> New content smartphone. You can use your phone to access various types of content. Check your current missions and more. Game settings can be accessed from the phone. Oh god, okay. <laughs> oh, I wonder how many of these will get my stream muted. Oh, I can only I can only like play it when it's right there. Okay. Hmm. Mini games. No games to play. That's sad. Wait, what did Limebot do now? <laughs> fish. Yoink. Or was it red starfish that she wanted? So is this just another game that's secretly actually like... Ocean horror? Because I'm down for it. Fuck you, Dory! Ooh. Oh, cool. I can use that while I'm down here. Cha! Oh. I might be bad at this harpoon thing. Got 
got him first try. Oh, overfish. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Thank you. I want this. Gimme. Maybe I don't have good enough equipment. Or maybe I need to weaken it first. Ow, fuck. <laughs> Oops. Am I dead? Come on, I, I want to poison my guests. Yeah, mine. What's this? What's this? What's this? Silver bowl. I probably should have read that when I was looking at it. Copper or used to craft weapons. I see. <gasps> What's this? What's this? Get him. Oh. Too powerful. <gasps> oh, look at this fish. Get him. Okay, I thought that was gonna happen. <laughs> Alright, fine. Nice. I, li I like the graphics. It's pretty. I'll just slowly murder this fish. <laughs> Any minute now. My fish. Oh, too heavy. Oh, I, I cannot. What if... What if I overburden myself, though? No, I cannot. Okay, fine. Sorry, Puffer's worth a lot. Wait, the green humphead pirate fish is only worth 16 gold? That's dumb. Oh, but it's times five, so that's better, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. Dave, did you get to loosen up hmm. yesterday? I saw a lot of nasty fish. It won't be easier to go d easy to go deeper. I did notice that the fish in the blue hole have an odd violent streak. Perhaps something puts them on edge? Could it be the giant tentacles? Speaking of which, why don't you also take a gun in addition to the harpoon? A gun? I have a friend who's knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you to him. <laughs> it's man's name is Duff. Wow, Cobra, it's been a while. Who's the goofy looking guy next to you? Sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger. I'm Dave, a professional diver. Interesting, I thought divers were athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. <laughs> People who live in glass houses. Mm -hmm. So what's this about? I'd like you to get straight to the point. Hello. I've begun a very interesting business. Ha ha ha. Hello. And now I'm in need of some weapons. Duff, I need your help. Hello. Season 2 of Strastella just ended anyway. I'll give you a listen. Hello. I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. <laughs> the terrain and ecology inside it changes every time you go inside. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when brought out. Hello. I'd like to make us, you to make us a weapon that can be used inside. Yeah. That's rather interesting. You piqued my interest as a weapon researcher, you could say. Uncertain Citrus, thank you for the 15 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. My hypothesis is that anything that's not made from materials found in the blue hole will continue to break down. Yeah. This will be especially true of guns, which have precision parts. Oh, 
So we have to get materials from the sea ourselves. Mm -hmm. Dave, you'll have to prove yourself as a diver to this master duff. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure why I should have to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Mm -hmm. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think I'll need one rope and one scrap iron. You heard him, right, Dave? Enter the blue hole and bring back rope and scrap iron. If you run out of oxygen midway, you'll only be able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. Caddy K, thank you for the 17 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. And thank you again on certain citrus. Yes, I saw a tentacle. This is a lot of fun so far. I see a starfish. Do you see the starfish? Oh. What's that over there? Oh, it's rope! I don't grab my carrying capacity as well. I'm gonna leave that oxygen till I come back. You. Fishing weapon. <laughs> okay. Oink. Battered fish, very good. <laughs> it feels cruel. I'm sorry, fish. What up, dude? Yoink. Oh god. Hold on a second. These fish aren't gonna get me, right? Oh god, oh god, oh man, oh god, oh man. Ooh, I don't like that. Get out of here. Yeah, easy peasy. I wasn't worried. Oh, I am overburdened again. This is absolutely the limiting factor here. Oh shit. do anything? I think it makes you consume more oxygen. Yeah, you can see on the bottom left there. I use a lot. There we go. You actually brought them back? I guess I expected too little of you. Why is everyone so mean? <laughs> this should do for now. I'll give you a reward as promised since you helped me do my research. The sudden ecological changes in this region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue to need your services. Add my number. Gold, olive oil, and soy sauce. Nice. Mr. Russell, thank mm -hmm. you for the 86 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you very much. This is really fun. I, I don't know, this this feels like one of those games that you could get, like, horrifically addicted to. <laughs> you think you'd actually manage to bring it back? I expect you to quietly expire in the depths, you could say. What the hell? Seems I've underestimated you slightly very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. Download Duff's Weapon Shop on your phone. It's well optimized. Only 42 meg, you could say. <laughs> I love his laptop. <laughs> you think he watches my stream? Oh, 
Oh god. Nice new username. I love it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I have made a basic underwater rifle. With a neat explanation like that, even someone like you should have understood. Well, I guess. Oh, and one more thing. I've taken some measures to allow you to open weapon chests underwater. Wow, weapon chests? You can't bring them out of the sea, but they can still come in handy, you could say. Oh, but I'll collect info about weapons you pick up and create blueprints for you. Uh, weapons made with a blueprint won't break down underwater. In any case, this monster will be watching you. Goodbye, Eternity. What? <laughs> Is this game on Switch? I hope so. It would really suit the Switch. Acquiring a weapon a certain amount of times will complete a blueprint, making the weapon craftable. Go hunting with powerful weapons. Nice! Oh, Dave, you collected 100 gold! Great job, this should be enough to repair what's broken. Give me some time, the repairs need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming! Hmm... Nintendo Switch later this year? Ah, I see. Cool. really want some sushi? <laughs> Plays great on the Steam Deck? Oh, nice! That's good to know. What's this thing over here? Like a vegetable counter. that decides to sit on the very end of the bar? I mean, you could have sat up front, give me less, less to run, but no, you're all the way over there, you shit. two fish. I 
like the, the 3D effect on the boats. Are you Dave by any chance? This is Dr. Bacon. Here you go. Yes, what is it, sir? I'm always right about these things. Haha, -ha, nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the sea people civilization. The fucking what now? <laughs> I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky to have an expert like me to tell you about them? Everyone in this game is mean and, and sucks. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have asked. Oh, hello. What? <laughs> the sea people civilization lives in legends. They are said to have occupied this region a long time ago. They worshipped fish and had gills allowing them to live underwater. <laughs> they lived in the depths allowing them to flourish without any concern for invasions by other civilizations. But sudden changes to the sea bottom brought about their abrupt downfall. That's about all there is to the story. Everyone thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course, but proof that they were real was found right in the vicinity of this place. Huh? That's an amazing find, one that could turn the whole academic world upside down. An ancient civilization under the sea. You'd only see such things in comic books or games. What makes you so sure they were real? My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that it is from no known civilization. It's dated to around 1500 years ago as well. There were no civilizations in these parts back then. How is game? It's so much fun! I'm having an amazing time! <laughs> it's like a really good pick up and play kind of game, like for a Steam Deck or, or uh, anything portable. That is interesting, but what business do you have with me? My assistant's cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out and he won't be around for a good while. That's why I'd like you to help me. Oh. My assistant told me that the artifact was found 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. Mm. We're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can. Sorry to interrupt the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dave. Of course we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Yeah. Ha -ha. Yeah. What? We don't have the time to sw swim around looking for artifacts. Think about it. If an underwater civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. Bancho Sushi will be bursting at the seams. Mm. I suppose you have a point. <laughs> All right, I'll help. Isn't that lucky? Of course, I won't be asking you to work for free. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're wearing. <gasps> wow! With an enhanced diving suit, you'll be able to venture deeper. This is essential for exploration. These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Technological advancements are amazing, huh? Let's install the iDiver app on the phone before we proceed. The iDiver app allows you to enhance various diving equipment, upgrade equipment with money you make at the sushi bar and elsewhere, and explore deeper waters. Let me tell you how to use iDiver, I'll install the app for you, so unlock your phone. Wow! Oh, look, 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 you can upgrade your capacity and your harpoon gun and your diving gun. This game is great. This game is great! You'll be able to venture a bit deeper. Once you have enough money, use iDiver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suit as well as your cargo box and oxygen tank. Never forget that anything can happen in deep waters. I'll be in touch. Can I upgrade anything more? I have money. Equip my gun. I just realized that the gun that I made is not equipped. I need to figure out how to do that, but when I next dive. Poison tip harpoon. Wow. It's definitely okay to feed my customers fish that were previously poisoned, right? This 
escape pod. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first, and the calling as the calling process takes some time. Gotcha. Beep. Oh no. Beep. Beep. Sure, they work all day under the sun, they slave away. Oh. <laughs> I am overburdened. Stinking lemons. <clears throat> I don't quite see the, the drawback to being overburdened yet. I haven't been po uh, poisoned, uh, punished for it yet. Speaking of. Mwahaha! I think I did knock him out and then I accidentally woke him back up again. Okay, that's that's as much as I can carry. So the escape pod doesn't punish me though, right? Like I can just I don't drop anything. One. Thank you for the 40 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. While you're out at sea, the repairs were completed. Let's head to the restaurant. But, but my diving! Wow, it's looking very nice. It doesn't matter how delicious the food is, the restaurant can't be a mess. If you want to change the interior, the interior menu below is open, so please check it. Oh, nice. But, as Dr. Bacon said, if the remains of the sea people are found here, customers will indeed come. This area is kind of remote, so I think we need a way to advertise the store until then. Mm. These days, it's about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Mm. Have you tried the social... I did I did not read that right. Have you tried the social media app named Cooksta? <laughs> you mean the social media app young people use to post pictures of the food they eat? Yeah, that's how old businesses are promoting themselves lately. <laughs> I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographs. Mm. Even so, isn't it better to use than to keep people ignorant of your food, Bancho? You have a point there. Mm. Making an account is simple, so let's try it out. Mm. You first register and make the hashtag Bancho underscore sushi, then done. That's not as complicated as I expected. New, new customers happy with your food will follow Bancho sushi. I'm not sure about this, but okay, I got it. I'll install the Cooksta app on my phone and check the followers' posts. 
Raise your rating in Cooksta. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlocked conditions of new ratings can be seen in the Cooksta app. There's a staff button, which I'm excited about. Ooh, I like that. That's nice, nice, nice. Hmm. What do you think? Oh, I accidentally just spent money on that. <laughs> I didn't realize it cost. Well, rip. Oh, I can't actually afford to do it, so it doesn't matter. Let's have a look at the Cooksta app. <laughs> What are my rewards for hitting bronze? A menu slot, kitchen staff, and wasabi amount. Nice. <laughs> I like that in-focus in finger, out-of-focus face. <laughs> I'm gonna like it. Chillin' Bellum, thank you for the two months. Welcome back. Oh, no, thank you so much. I appreciate having you here, and I'm glad you're enjoying. Uh, okay, can I go fish now? I wish to fish. <gasps> Cat, it's staring at you. His name is Momo! Mew, mew, mew! It did Momo. Oh. Alright, how do I... I have one of these. Yeah, I, I have... I have a gun. How do I equip gun? Maybe this? Ah, here we go. Oh, it is equipped. Huh, weird. I don't know how I equip it. Or use it, even. Hi, Groot! I see Ulu. <gasps> Delphi? Question mark. What's that? Timmy's in the well? A dolphin? It seems to be asking me to follow. Should I try and follow? Yes. Yes, you should. Let's go. Drop it. Oh no! The pink dolphin is caught in the net. I was it was asking me to rescue its friend. I should cut that net. I shall. Save her! Oh, they dropped an anal pearl. the dolphin? Fuck you. It seems to have left a gift. I didn't even know dolphins had mates. Girl. Triple Axel. Ugh. I'll try it. How do I use it? Oh, A. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I 
I like how I'm suddenly down here shooting shooting fish with a my automatic weapon. Rip fish. <gasps> Another cheap Japanese sword. Hell yeah. What's this game? Dave the Diver. <gasps> fish. Yeah. I'ma eat ya. I'ma put you in my belly. <gasps> Potentially a clue for the ancient civilization. Oh, Dave, I think that's the one. Come back to the boat safely. I'll be waiting. What, what do you mean? What are you doing? Oh, God. Oh god. <gasps> Fucking run! <laughs> oh dear. That's a lot of tentacle. <laughs> Very good. W what was that just now? I have to go back to the boat right away. What if I didn't, though? Ah, <gasps> a sharp Japanese sword! Hell yeah! Boom. Yeah, I don't think the- I don't think the boat would really help. <laughs> Well, it's probably not sharp anymore, now I just use it to fucking <laughs> hit lead. Oh. Hold on, I have a cutting plan, and it involves shooting fish. Come back! You shits. Yeah, boy. Mackerel. <laughs> okay, no, I'll go back up. Start opening opening up that oh, there we go. What's that? Shock harpoon. Nice. Slowly, slowly. <laughs> slowly. <laughs> Harpoon gun, a uh, smaller fish, you can just straight up uh, pull them into your bags immediately. All right, you brought it out safely. It seems to be in very good condition, almost as if it was stored somewhere until recently. Very interesting. This might be the find of the century, even. All right, Dave, let's continue to work together and uncover the secrets of the Sea People civilization. What? I thought I'd only be helping you once. Of course, say no more. Just put our restaurant at the top of the list of affiliates. <laughs> that won't be hard to do. I'm a very lucky feeling about this. I'll be in touch. 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure murdering all the fish with the gun does bring down their uh, value a little bit. <laughs> it's really fun, Bestie. It's like super pretty. And it's just one of those games where I feel like I'm going to end up like getting way too many hours out of it. It's already evening. Mm -hmm. I feel stiff. Even so, Bancho's working alone. I should probably help. Ah, <laughs> we're about to get stuff, I think. It's not easy to manage with two peop two pe with two people with more customers coming in. Did I just see like a shark go by in the background there? I just saw a dark shape go cruising by. Should I be concerned? Looks around. This is Banjo's sushi place, huh? Hmm. But Miss Yoshi! I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cooksta. The name gave me pause, but to think it's really your place. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A taciturn but masculine chef. Wow, do they mention me too? No, not really. <laughs> I feel bad for Dave. He seems like a half-decent person. <laughs> He's getting shat on constantly. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, there's nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day, training myself. My goodness, that is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion, and that's what got you booted from the hotel. <gasps> You're talking about that again. This is the cu that's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. Mm. How long will you continue treating customers that way? Mm. To keep making that terrible food? Mm. What do you mean terrible? Whole roasted shark head is an excellent dish. Mm. <laughs> shark has been used in cuisine in both the West and the East, and in Korea it was even used in ancestral rituals. Mm. Stop, you've not changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then whether it's food fit for consumption. Mm. Then I can tell you why I came. Mm. Fine then, I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the true taste of shark head meat. Banjo, isn't this development a bit sudden? Dave, as a chef, this is a fight I can't back out of. My pride hangs in the balance. Please get me a white tip reef shark head in olive oil. <laughs> you want me to catch a white tip reef shark? Yes, with your skills, it should be easy enough to do. But a harpoon's not likely to be enough. Take a good gun with you into battle. Even so, fighting a shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say you'll stand, just stand by and watch with my pride get trampled? The white tip red reef shark is usually found in the ocean far to the right. Good luck. He suddenly wants me to get him a shark head? This is preposterous, and it can only be killed with a gun? I'll have to ask Duff to make me a gun or search for one in the blue hole. Sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and serve them to the customers. You can now research new recipes. Use the artisan's flame to expand your menu. Wow. Very good. Cuttlefish. Thank you for the seven months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, there's a lot of life in the uh, and, and and love going into the cutscenes, which is really cool. Oh God, you all want one? Fish. 
I like how the customers say the lovely stuff. <laughs> Ooh, look, we got a cookster post. money I'm making. Nice. I am five stars. Again, what would you want? I got the luckiest news. What is it, Dr. Bacon? You look happy. I analyzed the artifact you brought me, and a large amount of an unknown substance was detected. It must be iron compressed deep underwater, but it gives off a unique wavelength. I went ahead and developed a radar to track those waves. And why is that news lucky? Being coy today, are we? The radar is bound to come in useful on your next expedition. What do you mean, my next expedition? Cobra forced me to go along last time. I was given a contract with your name on it. The cancellation charge for breaking the contract is over 20. What? What in the world were you two talking about? Don't be so by the book. Check the signal for me to test out the radar. Ugh, give it to me. I'll tell you if it works and no more. Bye, Evie. Ooh, a new post. Oh, God. Passion filled sushi at night. I will like it. Blue cut sushi, the color of the sea. Tasted good too. Heard shots like these are the trend now. Heard this fish is poisonous, but it tastes good actually. <laughs> I'm interacting. The sushi's here nice. I don't like the strange guy serving it though. What? Removing my like. Fuck you. I'm doing my best. Why does everyone hate him so much? He <laughs> doesn't seem all that bad. <laughs> da -da, da -da -da. Hmm. Better harpoon gun. Does upgrading my suit make me swim faster? I feel like I'm going pretty fast now. I know it makes me dive deeper, but does it make me swim faster too? Oh yeah, maybe it's because I'm not carrying anything. So far though, the gameplay loop on this is really satisfying. Okay, okay, okay. Don't picnic. Don't picnic. Whoa, juice. Thank you for the four years. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Oh, Lord. Uh. Shark bait. Ah. 
Ah! 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 He wants to hurt me. Shirk, you are bad at your job. <laughs> slice and dice. And slice and dice. Nice. It hurts. I don't think sea urchins can be picked up with these gloves. Oh. I need to upgrade my gloves. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Maybe I shouldn't have gone down here without any guarantee. There we are. Oxygen. Beep. Nice. Ooh, high quality as well. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what is this fish? Squeaker. Squeaker. Nice coral trout. Oh, it takes eight seconds. Alright, gotcha. Makes sense. Squeaker. the frig is that? Well, critical depth. I should probably not be here. I'll have to wait for another upgrade. Deflect that like no bitch. <laughs> yep, yeah, we go. Just keep swimming. Oh, yeah, maybe I hit the wall. That makes sense. I'm hurting fish? Yes, because they are delicious. Yeah, yeah, I think I can craft the, the pistol now. Backwards red hat and a blue jacket. Isn't Ash's Ash's Japanese name Satoshi? <laughs> I see what you're doing there. Look at him. <laughs> I 
Hoppity hop! You, do you know a lot about this giant blue hole? Mm. Is he gonna ask me to catch them all? Well, I'm not sure what to say to that. It's different in there every time. Yes, that's it. It's the best place to catch... to collect Marinka. I could complete my collection in this place. <laughs> Marinka? What? Don't tell me you don't know of the highly popular Ocean Life trading cards, Marinka. How can you not have heard of the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to fish in real life? Um, never heard of them. Sounds fun, though. You are quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. So you do this, then press here, touch that, add a friend. Done. Uh, okay, so what do I do now? Mm. The amazing thing about these Marinka is you don't really need to do anything special. Just catch a few fish, you'll get a card. So I catch a new fish and you'll get a card. Check the cards every now and again on the app and you're done. I see. I guess I'll be able to easily see which fish I've caught so far. That's right. It's almost like a... Whoa, you don't want to be saying the name. I understand. I'll try it out. <laughs> I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Sato. <laughs> I'll give you my contact info, so hit me up if you have questions. So see you then, Choo Choo. <laughs> um... You get fancier cars for catching higher grade fish. Wow. I need gold. What's this gun? Gun enhancement kit uses single parts... The single use parts kit used to enhance guns. Oh, nice! I have enhanced my gun. Baseball bat! I love this thing. just find a pot of black vinegar down here. Eh. God damn it. Beat the shit out of it. Once it's sushified, nobody will be able to tell about, like, they won't be able to notice the baseball bat marks. Is that the Barracuda? <gasps> A sharp sword, yeah! Alright, let's fight. Let's go. <laughs> Great Barracuda is mine. Ah, 
no consequences. Ooh, Barracuda. Never punished. That fish looked big. Are there fish? Fa oh fuck! <laughs> Are there fish facts? I think so. I'll go and check my 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 pocket fish app in a second. Fish info too, that's cute. Oh god, look at the size of some of these. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, no, it wants me to hurt the dolphin! Never. Oh, actually, it has a pic- it has a photograph set. Like, can you see there's a photo icon? Maybe I just need to take a picture of it rather than murder it. Jesus Christ! one point, I was almost gonna be an ocean VTuber because I was gonna do like a seal, but then I was like, no, I want to be a ferret. And instead, I am a ferret. I am pleased with my decision. Taste score will increase customer satisfaction. Never stop learning. Wait, if that lady's not here, is it a waste to serve the fish head? Yeah, she's not here. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. Oh no, there she goes. So. Maybe that can be one of my outfits sometime in the future. I will put a seal kigu on my mail. Disgusting as usual, the look of it just ruins my appetite. Even so, a promise is a promise. <laughs> How do you like it? It's good, it's tasty, I can taste the white tip reef shark fat inside the crispy whole roast. But it's not an overly cloying flavor, is... is this ginger? The ginger scent mixes with the strong flavor of the head. <laughs> it's quite lovely. Mm. Uh, pardon me, I wasn't expecting it to be this good. Mm. The Book of Five Rings states that one should look at the essence of something instead of its appearance. Mm. Sharks look terrible on the outside, but they have robust meat and their head has a delicious taste. Mm. This whole roasted shark head brings such traits to their maximum potential. Mm. I must admit it, this is good. You pass, Bancho. Mm. Let me tell you why I'm here, then. This restaurant needs to hire people. I can help you with that. Huh? What do you mean? Do you still mean to go it alone, Banjo? This place is already operating at full capacity. Things might be okay for now, but you won't be able to cope when even more customers come. 
I can't continue working alone, but it's not easy to find people I can trust. I'm Yoshi the Recruiter. This is what I do these days. Let's start by putting out a hiring ad. Um, I'm in the middle of a shift. Hire employees to reduce the workload. Employees help serve food in the dining area or make cooking food faster. <clears throat> Let me tell you how to recruit staff. Pay close attention to what I say. Press X to post a hiring notice. Press the flyer to begin hiring notice. Uh, oh, I see, I see. Good. The recruitment results become available the following day. I'll tell you more tomorrow. I'm having such a good time. I just love like the, the fish fishing exploring by day, restaurant sim by night. <laughs> Skipping this cutscene, I'm going to watch it every single time. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Okay, now I need this one too. Obliterated my profits from other days. Oh, God, what do you want? You haven't quit diving yet, have you? Uh, what is it this time? Um, I'm doing some investigating for an important paper and I'm gonna need some help. Get me three blue shells and three brown shells. Okay, but aren't you supposed to do this sort of thing yourself? Are you kidding me? Writing a paper requires a ton of research and investigation. What you're doing is only a very tiny part of it all. So don't let it get to your head. Hurry along. I don't have much time until the deadline. You really are impossible. Uh, yeah, Banjo is the one, uh, cooking. But since you say it's for a paper, was it blue shells and brown shells? Oh boy, let's have a look at cook stuff. <gasps> shark sushi has a manly taste. I feel stronger. I like how he's fashioned it to look like a shark. <gasps> we got an award! Please come visit! I like this one. I can afford another upgrade. I'm gonna go for this one. Hey. Hey. Uh, 
Oh, I'm poor again. <laughs> I could go fight another shark. Does Limes love sushi? I love sushi. It's probably one of my favorite things ever. <gasps> Dolphin! What's up, buddy? I'll help you. Kill it? Fuck you! You must be the dolphin from before. Why does it look like it's in a hurry? I wonder if something's going on. Come to think of it, I don't see the pink dolphin this time. I should follow. Let's go save the pink dolphin! <gasps> no! Save her! Oh no, the pink dolphin! Pirates must have captured it illegally. I should quickly cut its net. Oh god, it's gonna take forever. Oh, they're shooting at me! What the fuck? <gasps> Don't hit the dolphin! I win! Oh, oh we're okay, we're good, we're good. Jesus. another gift. I hope neither of them gets caught again. A large gold bar. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Worth. We're rich. Kill this yet? Ow. <laughs> SFXer, thank you for the 28 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Gun refills. Oh, hello. Oh, dingus! Fuck you! I don't seem to be able to hit it. Or, like, you know, kill it. A 
Actually, I think it was here, wasn't it? Okay, so it's not here this time. Okay, so taking damage is just oxygen, I think. <laughs> I did not mean to shoot that fish. I'm sorry. Surely there is some way to fight this eel. It just seems to bounce off. Bransty, thank you for the 17 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. No, okay. believe the eel. Oh, maybe you can only hit it when it's like protruding out of the uh the thing. Maybe, I don't know. Hmm. Wasn't I supposed to be testing out a radio? Follow the signal's location. But wait, how? Did I miss did I miss how to use the radar? Do you want to buy nice cars, wear fancy clothes, getting rich is easier than you think? C click the button below. <laughs> I don't understand why this button's not working. Was it at the top of the screen? Oh, is it underneath my phone again? Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it is. It's underneath my phone. I can't see it. Why am I a VTuber? Fun. No, I had to go back to my other setup because uh, having my phone horizontal was messing it up. Chat, can you read what the thing says for me? Is it like I have to go down and right? my presence to be an online character instead of actually me. Again, fun. It's fun. It's like playing dress up every day.
I don't want to fight this thing. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Ooh! I've ever done. Ah. Jesus. <laughs> That's a big fish. made myself slow. Wait, question. If I pick up whatever's on the radar, do you think it's gonna spawn another giant, uh, squid? Wow, so this is the place. Let's see. The signal is coming from inside the room! There are letters I've never seen before written on the pillar. If we had a tool of some sort, we could try move aside that pile of rocks. I think it would be best to talk this over with Cobra. Come on up for now. They're summoning Cthulhu. I thought I heard something. I didn't really detect any overt rudeness from that person, so please, please, please be nice, friends. Do not, do not worry. But yeah, no, I genuinely, I do VTubing because it's fun. And I like having a character to play. And it's, it's, it's kind of neat because like, you, you know, getting new outfits, new model, things like that. It's, it's like, you know, being able to play dress up and, and just... Have a have a super fun time with it. Yeah, you, like I could have my online identity just be me, but it's also really fun and and neat to be able to like make a character, things like that. I found a place with a signal from. When do we get snoo outfits and models? That's for me to know and for you to find out. Mm -hmm. A signal from the Sea People Civilization. I can't hold back my academic thirst to check it out. I'm at an important symposium right now. Please talk it over the Cobra first. I'll come by tomorrow. I want to get rid of rock piles? You'll have to use a bomb. <laughs> of course. Is it okay to detonate bombs underwater? Weren't you talking about a rock pile somewhere deep below? I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's put a little trust in the sea's regenerative, regenerative power. He's trying to gloss over things again. But there's an issue. The delivery ships haven't been arriving lately. I need to get a delivery from a bomb expert I know. Apparently the ship's gone off the radar. I think it's sunk. I could, If I could use the drone I ordered, we could retrieve the supplies. Could you go into the sea and retrieve drone materials? How am I supposed to find those in the ocean? It's huge. Delivery boxes are likely to have been carried by the ocean currents. Look for a place with ocean currents. That sounds dangerous. <laughs> Yeah, that's the point as well. I didn't use a face cam before I started VTubing, so it was nice to be able to add, like, visual reactions to the things that I'm doing. Hmm, already? That was harder than expected. These are hard to find. Well, this isn't bad. Now then, if I just complete the delivery to Eco Watcher, Ta-da! 
research level gained. Huh? Eco Watcher? Oh, you don't know? Eco Watcher is a mission based app made to protect the environment. You get points for completing missions on the app and get rewards for reaching certain levels. So this was for points on the app and not for a paper? Oh, uh, well, you could say they're basically the same thing. You try it out too if you're interested. See ya. <laughs> okay. Gather points to retrieve, receive various rewards. Nice. I like it's like preserve the environment. I just killed like two sharks today. <laughs> Hmm. Ah, <gasps> a new applicant. Time to have a look, see. Oh, I wasn't expecting an applicant so quickly. <laughs> Let's check out who we have. <laughs> this is a pretty nice resume we have here. <laughs> Let's hire this person straight away. Okay, so they're gonna be serving. Nice. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> All right, looks like we have our first staff. Pirate staff must be placed. Uh, staff can be placed in the kitchen or the dining area. Add them to your kitchen to cook more quickly and to your dining area to serve food more quickly. As for our first staff, let's try a dining area assignment for now. I think that should be enough to go on for now. I'm stating the obvious, but things will get tough without staff to help once more customers start coming in. There's also training to consider besides hiring. That's all for now. Ow. Opening only for the evening, but I'm too exhausted at such a late hour. That's why you wake up later. <laughs> oh, I can't afford to hire anyone else. <laughs> Time to make money! Now I've hired more staff. I might need. I might have needed more sushi. Uh oh. I uh, I accidentally moved the stick back. My bad. <laughs> Serve tea? It doesn't look like it. Oh, I definitely need another cook. Holy shit. <laughs> Yeah, there's no point having two servers if there's only one chef. <laughs> Much worse. Nice. Just 
She doesn't even pick up the dishes, right? Maybe that's training I have to unlock. I forgot to tell you something. What is it, Miss Yoshi? When you hire more employees and purchase more ingredients, you will have to take care of many things at once. So I decided to give you a management app which works on your smartphone. You can check the current situation of Bancho Sushi at any time using it. You can check the status of your restaurant without visiting it. That sounds handy. I already linked the app. Why don't you check it on your smartphone? I'm sure Bancho Sushi will grow bigger and prosper. Yay. Management. Oh. Can I hire staff from here? No. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> da, 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 da. Mm. Research points. Whatever those are. Rewards eco health brace bracelet. I see. Okay, so let's quickly go and put in a thing for another person in the kitchen. Uh, hiring. I'm gonna be cheap for now. Thought she had a gun. <laughs> the most aggressive of hiring strategies. <laughs> I love his photos. <laughs> Everything's out of focus except the person at the end of the bar. <laughs> Okay, let's dive, I think. I think I'm good to dive. Wait, no, 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 no. Eye diver. Cargo box. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Hola, gatito! sick right now? I'm sorry. I hope you feel better soon. I'm looking for certain types of plant, I think. Oh, that's nice. Nice, nice. Ooh, Barracuda. I can kill this thing Woo! with my current gear because I had like a triple upgraded gun last time. <laughs> oh lord, ow! A 
Bigman have run out of nectar, but I already flew home! Have they considered learning how to fend for themselves? Under your bed? Well, you're in the wrong room because I'm not in my bedroom. Oh shit. <laughs> Would you mind making the bed before you leave? Thank you. find another oxygen thing so I don't have to use my portable... Oh my fucking lord! Do you see it? Did you see it? Did you see it? Did you see it, chat? It was huge! You didn't see it? I get it for you. Hold on. Huh. I found a bomb. Look at it! What the fuck is that? <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Uh. No, don't ink me right now. Are you kidding? I'm fighting a shark. Oh, this thing's... Oh, this thing's hella aggressive. I don't think I can fight it. Get off my ass, sir! Beep! Large lad. Oh! Boo, thank you for the 10 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. I don't think I just screwed myself. My lungs are collapsing. This will teach them to be stronger. Maybe I can kill it with a triple axle. I don't think so, though. I think that shark's gonna kick my ass. I could leave a depth charge. <laughs> like, here we go. <laughs> Run! Holy fuck! I might be too slow for this now. Oh! I I fucked up. I'm gonna get eaten. Oh! Dead. <laughs> Evil duck of doom. Thank you for the 27 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Uh oh. That uh that that shark might be a bit much for me. <laughs> No, the, pro the problem was I was too heavy, so I there was no way I could escape him. This giant blue hole looks infinitely more dangerous than any other place. Always pay attention to your oxygen. <laughs> I can risk you if you run out of oxygen, but you only be able to bring back one of the items you collected. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's not like I don't have a backlog of fish to serve anyway. Yeah. <laughs>
I'm sad that I messed up that, but it, it feels like I'm not quite strong enough to kill that shark. Because he just sits on top of me, and I can't kill him. Look how fast I am now. Can't stop moving and they drown. Have they tried just getting good? Sounds like a scale issue. Flame harpoon! Nice. Is it sushi though if I cook it before it even reaches the the chef? Oh, sorry, I did not realize. Hold on. <laughs> Easy game. <gasps> My beautiful, sharp Japanese sword. Do you think I can get, like, melee weapons pre-made? I haven't managed to do that yet. I'm gonna go where the currents are, right? I'm gonna go murder the shark first. The melee weapons currently deteriorate when I come out from the dive. But my ranged weapons used to be like that too, and I can make permanent ones now. So I'm wondering if I'll eventually get like upgraded melee weapons. Royal Guard! I can't say the word Axel without pronouncing it like the guy from Prince of Persia. Axel! Oh, come right. Let's not lose our heads, though. QTE. 
Okay. Limestone cave. I like that stone. Lightning harpoon. <laughs> that sounds very dangerous down here. Is there a way to like throw out the stuff that I... Oh, I can't. I can discard heavy stuff. Nice. So I can actually min-max here a little bit. I might throw out the barracuda meat. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna throw out a little bit of barracuda meat. Actually... I don't know what's worth more. Okay, cool. where they said I should go for the pieces of, uh... The dr oh lord! Zip zap, motherfucker! Oh, I missed. Zip zap, motherfucker, again! Oh. He's not pleased. A question mark. Yeah, boy. Oh. A tennis racket. Hit the polyester strings precisely to send the bull flying father. No. Well, yeah, okay, fine. Because I've not used this before. It will be funny. Never mind, it's less funny. Anibria, thank you for the two years. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. How are you? Targets, t targets caught in the net will be of high grade. Nice. Camera lens. Almost there. No, we actually we saw a cutscene where the ship that was supposed to be delivering all of these parts got murdered by a kraken. Or a giant squid. Ah. Or a giant kraken, yeah. <gasps> it didn't work! He doesn't give a fuck! Easy game. You eighteen! Welcome back. Thank you again, Corby. Now, do I go down in the hope that I find an escape thingy? Or do I go up? Because, you know, there's no guarantee of that. <laughs> Golf club. Ooh. How dare you? No. I'm going up. Oh, there's one. No problem. 
I'm pretty heavy right now. Thanks for noticing. <laughs> we should be able to deploy a drone with this. You look pretty exhausted. The sea currents did knock me around a bit. Aha, I see. I'll take a bit of time to repair the drone and deploy it. Please wait a while. It should be done by tomorrow morning. Go about your business until then. Damn, son, that's a lot of money. This game is called Dave the Diver. Hmm. Have so much fish to sell. I'm gonna try and just like get some of this out of the out of my storage. <laughs> The cutscenes are amazing. I love them. Custom, sorry, the other waiter is not bothering to serve green tea. I don't know why. It's very annoying. We definitely need another chef. Holy moly. <laughs> this. I hope whatever is coming is for this person. It's genuinely a fun game. Yeah, I figure I need to train them. Money! I couldn't come by yesterday because of the symposium. Did you speak to Cobra? <laughs> come to think of it, I got materials since Cobra said he was repairing a drone yesterday. <laughs> oh, a bit late, aren't I? <laughs> I just I repaired the drone just fine thanks to you. I got some supplies as well. Here's the bombs you asked for. Also. <laughs> oh, thank you, Dr. Bacon. Will these do? 
let's head back to the rock pile. Oh, wait, I haven't finished. Starting today, the Cobra shop is officially open. The what? Deliveries have stopped, but with that drone in working order, I can transport three types of items in a day. Talk to me and select the Cobra shop to see a list that changes every day. I'll also buy some stuff you don't need. Check out the sell tab as well. I have a feeling you'll charge high prices, but it's nice to be able to prepare. I won't charge you high prices just because I've got the only business here, so don't be afraid to visit often. <laughs> I feel like you let your business tactics slip just now. In any case, it's time to head back to the rock pile where the signal from the sea people was detected. I don't remember where that was. <laughs> Oops. You can buy auxiliary items and sell your items at the Cobra shop. The, the Cobra shop is only accessible in the morning and afternoon. Purchased items can only be used for one day, so keep that in mind. Just in case there's something worth documenting inside, how about taking this underwater camera? <gasps> A camera? It will be important for research to record important data with photos. Take the camera and I'll let you know when I find the right place to use it. Cool. I'm gonna get rated! Oh. is still in progress? That sucks. Yeah, the cutscenes are just so good. I love them. Uh, it did give us more staff spots, but we can't even actually, like, uh... hire anyone right now. We're in the middle of a campaign. Yay! Like post. Oh my god, we get it to get to diamond. Alright. Oh yeah, Cobra store. Oxygen capsule, oxygen tank expansion. It cannot be reused. Increases maximum oxygen capacity by 10. I'm assuming that's not a permanent upgrade. So let's head down towards... Okay, it's got the radar back again. Shock bang stick.
The game is really, really pretty, and I love I love the gameplay loop. So I'm having a great time. Oh, fish! I mean, shark. <laughs> Poison harpoon. Hmm. Where'd the shark go? Where'd the shark get? Way up there. This is the white tip that we bought earlier. That's unfortunate. <laughs> uh oh. Easy, I wasn't worried. A gun refill up here? Yeah. And we'll just have to hope there's oxygen down here somewhere. There's no way I'll get unlucky and there just won't be any, right? Thanks for being here, Safi. Have a good one. The poison, the poison adds flavor. Don't worry about it. I kind of want to see how I do with this one. Sometimes it feels better. Zap that kelp. Wait, is it up from here? It is. Huh. What's gonna be in the Cave of Wonders? I lied. Oh, wait, no, it's only level one, so never mind. I will go back to that one. We're here! Try placing one of the bombs Cobra gave you on that rock pile. This feels unsound. All good? You know, it's sort of hard to see through the radio. We can't have you torn to a thousand pieces and become food for the sharks. That's a scary thing to say in such a casual voice. Now back away from the bomb. There, that should be enough. Here it goes! Nice, now the road is clear. There's a faint light coming from inside. Go on inside. Wait, what if there's a monster in there? That would also be an amazing scientific discovery! <laughs> New region? <gasps> More fish? Wow, this place is wow. It appears to be some kind of sea people record chamber. My lucky feeling was correct. There definitely was a sea people civilization in this region. Look at that mural back there. No human could have painted that so deep underwater. Maybe these are from some ancient civilization that sank from seismic activity? A good point, but that style of painting and architecture can't be seen anywhere above ground. Please first investigate this place. I'm sure you'll be able to find a variety of interesting clues. This can't be a natural pillar. There are even mysterious characters engraved in it. 
mural appears to be of a warrior or a king. Like, it looks powerful. There seem to be scales on the lower body. Is this really a mural of the sea people? Oh, I wanted to grab what that was. A painting of dolphins and marine plants. Apparently the sea people could draw, not only write. Good, that should be enough. I would like to research a little more, so please take a photo with the camera that I gave you. Ow. Uh, this is the full release, right? A camera icon indicates that you can take pictures. Check your objective on the top left. Use A to adjust the focus and remove your hand to take a picture. Make sure your timing matches the green indicators. Okay. Day. Thank you for the 39 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. I'll have some soup after the stream. I promise mm. I see something on the floor there. Oh, it might be another sea people artifact. Bring it to me Luna bunny. Thank you for the 35 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you A record chamber filled with sea people symbols. What could they have written? More importantly, didn't you hear something? What do you mean? I didn't hear anything over the radio. Come back up to the boat for now. What soup? Probably tomat today. I had leek and potato the other day. I'll finish out my my oh my fishing for today. There's three oxygen items here. Mm. It's too dark down here. It'll be dangerous to venture down in this state. Ooh. Exciting. I guess I'll go up. Ah, sawfish! I am not prepared to kill a sawfish right now. Oh, an escape pod. Perfect. I mean, I guess what I could do is leave a bunch of bombs. Did I kill the shark up here yet? I think I did. I don't remember, actually. Whatever. Bacon potato is good. I find that sometimes, like, 
depending on where you get it from, like, they go way too far in on the potato and there's not enough leak, so it's just like... It's like, a uh, Too plain, I guess? And not, not enough zest. A Sea People Artifact. Hmm, very interesting. Well, I'm glad you like it. I'll have to analyze this artifact in the mural further at my lab. I'll be in touch soon. Hi, Jiffy. How was your day in London? <laughs> this is John Watson. Hey, hey, you there! I heard an explosion in the sea. Do you know what's going on? Oh, oh, it's save the environment, people. We fucked up. <laughs> About that, um... We are Sea Blue! We are an organization that tracks down people who pollute this beautiful sea and reports them. I sometimes carry out justice myself for those that commit particularly evil deeds. I've had reports of someone who has been engaging in mindless destruction of the environment in these parts. I don't know if it was you, but you better be aware of this. Whoever harms the Great Sea will have to contend with Sea Blue. And me, John Watson! Now then, be ever grateful to the sea and never lose your love for it. I'll be leaving for now. <laughs> We're watching you. You saw a sign that said Cockfosters? Yes, there's a place in London called Cockfosters. I actually looked at houses there at one point, like for rent. Apartments, I mean. What a creepy dude. Will we be okay? Sea Blue, that group is infamous. They commit acts of violence under the pretext of environmental protection. It's mostly the large corporations with big fishing businesses. And not the small fisheries that harm the environment most. They say nothing to the corporations, however. I expect they're taking bribes or something unsavory like that. That guy looked like bad news. I won't, it won't do you any good to be on their radar. Be careful. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, oh, wait, we have a whole day left. Or an afternoon, at least. <laughs> oh, I should have checked my environmental app, because I think I have... Build on a few of those now. I need to figure out how to kill that thing. Maybe I need to engage it in melee combat. Also, I think I'm getting way more food than I can actually sell. work on things like sharks, I wonder? Like, can I trank a shark and get, like, a high-quality shark meat patch? Oxygen. Oh, that's cool, Chippy. I've genuinely never heard of this game before now, which is a shame because it's, it's absolutely the kind of game that I love. First try. <gasps> I am going to box the hell out of a fish. Let's go.
Red Sniper. Yeah, boy. I don't think I can go inside that boat. Oh! Oh god. Okay, that's a bad idea. Their hitbox is too big. turning circle. Uh-oh. That was quick. Catch of the day is these hands. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how this 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 uh game didn't come to my attention. Also, can I pick up ammo things and get extra ammo, or does it like cap out at whatever? Uh, you know what? I'll just test along. Nope. Okay, it's capped. I return to the limestone cave. The game has been in early access for a while, Galacta, as uh, a couple people just said. Yeah, the game the game looks nice, it plays well. Having a very good time. Yeah, like I, I've not personally heard of this game and I don't know how. Because I've been told that it's it's been quite popular with quite a few people. Let me get that gun, please. No 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 come on. No, I don't want the hush start. Dumb gun. Ow. How did I hear about it? A Reddit thread. It was like a, a review thread for the full release. fight that thing right now. I mean, hold on. JK. Oh no, fuck off. Ah! Ah, no, 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 my greed! My greed! My greed! I am being punished! You get fucked. No, 
consequences. I send. No, what's draining me too fast is getting hit. Your oxygen bar doubles as your life meter. One of them was called Raoul. Uh oh. VIP appeared, Vincent the Gourmet. Hello, viewers. This is Yui from the TV show Star the Chef. Today I've come to a seaside sushi bar that's all the rage on cook stuff Bancho Sushi. It's in this sushi bar that's famous for its exotic sushi, we have with us, with us the legendary sushi expert, Vincent Yama, Yamaoka. Yamaoka. Hmm. Ahem, I am Vincent Yamaoka. Hello, Vincent. How would you define sushi? Sushi is a very simple dish. There's only rice, vinegar, wasabi, and the fish that goes on top. Everything hangs upon these ingredients. However, simple does not mean easy. Listen! How good the ingredients are, how they were stored and aged, how they were cut, how the rice was cooked, and how it was molded. All these things matter in the art of sushi. Yes! I see. In that case, what do you think of the exotic sushi that Bancho Sushi is famous for? The ingredients for sushi have long been similar. The king of fish, the tuna, and particularly the belly. Below that, the olive flounder and amberjack with white and red meat, all verified ingredients you understand. To dare to use new ingredients despite the many proven ones that existed from the Edo era. Regardless of the taste, this shows a lack of respect. You have once criti criticized California rolls as not being real sushi. We're curious to see what your opinion on Bancho Sushi will be. Now then, let's start by introducing the star of today's show. This is the owner, Bancho. Um, this is a bit sudden. I'm called Ban- He's quite reticent. That can only mean he speaks through his cooking. The sushi bar offers a fantastic view as it's near the giant blue hole, and the chef sure gives off the vibes of a master. I'm really looking forward to how the food will taste. Vincent, which food will you be trying? I'm really in not really interested in the food of a place that's so focused on appearances. You there, Banjo, was it? Your name. Let me take a look at what you can do. Let me see. Bring me something to surprise me. Wow, Vincent offers a daring provocation. He left the menu for the chef to decide. I can't just sit by and listen to your prejudiced thinking. Give me two days and I'll be sure to shock you. A standoff between a traditional gourmet and an exotic chef. Things are getting real interesting. We'll come to you live in the next episode. Don't forget to tune in next time to Star the Chef. What are you thinking? What are you going to do? A man does not run from a challenge. I've thought of something. Will you get me the ingredients? I need some sea grape and white spotted jellyfish. They can both be harvested in the limestone cave. You'll need to capture the white spotted jellyfish alive. You'll need a tranquilizer gun or a net gun. Uh oh. Hmm, you're going to make sushi with those? Okay, a limestone cave, right? I'll go and look for them. What is my thought on people who are into armpits? <laughs> Whatever makes you happy, my dude. <laughs> I do, but I need to capture a jellyfish alive because I haven't done that yet. Oh god, there's a designated date. Oh, stress! Uh, let's see. Cooking. Ooh. <gasps> 66 and everything. Oh my god. Not enough hiring for. Holy shit. I cannot afford either of these. God damn. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. Mm. 
Not roll. Okay, so we gotta make some big money. One chef still. It's gonna be fine. I'm not falling behind or anything. Oh god, we're dead. We're fucked. We're beansed. We're boonered. We're gonna lose a customer because they're hungry. Ah, oh, crap. All the way over here. <laughs> I just wanted money. I'm fucked up a little bit. <laughs> Greedy? No, it's because I don't have enough people to stop the kitchen. Spring. I still made more money than any other day. <laughs> no consequences. Wait, what? <laughs> uh oh. What if the game asks me to make sushi out of the fish people? <gasps> oh. Hmm. It's the first time it's rained. Dave! Yes, Dr. Bacon? Dave! Yes. Do you want to hear the good news or the bad news? The good news. You're the positive type. I studied the bracelet you brought me yesterday. It was from the sea people, as I expected. Wow, so it's an ancient artifact? The bracelet seems to be imbued with a mysterious power. Here, you can wear this. Me, what, me? I mean, I'm grateful, but why? Who knows, there might be some frightening sea people curse on it. <laughs> In any case, try it on first. <gasps> Survive for a certain period after running out of oxygen. Oh, hells yeah! I feel some kind of new power inside me. Glad to hear nothing bad happened. You'll be able to check your diver box for more information about the charm you're wearing. I have more great news. I analyzed the artifacts and investigation data, and I was able to find a very strong signal in the ocean depths. This was the right place. The objects just don't float over here. I, the, I have a feeling the giant blue hole that suddenly appeared is serving as a conduit to the sea, to a sea people site. A very lucky opportunity. That sounds like I have to risk my life again. So, what's the bad news? In order to vin venture deep, you'll need a deep sea headlamp. Deliveries have stopped right now for some reason, so getting one is out of the question. Mm. Maybe Duff will have one? He has all sorts of things. Try contacting Duff. Okie doke. Limes 2.0 when? Perhaps sooner than you think.
research point. <laughs> I'm going to hire Raul. Nice. So now we have kitchen stuff. Thank fuck. Uh, I can't afford this guy as well, unfortunately. Talk to Duff. Oh, I think I should make a call first. There you go. Oh, call. Duff. Arg. Why are you so angry, Duff? I ordered a limited edition Leah's Chan figurine, but it hasn't come for over a week. Would you believe it? It's got a serial number and a limited edition only art book. Whoa, calm down a bit. Everyone seems upset with the deliveries having stopped. I think there must have been some kind of accident. Mm. To see what's going on, I will need the deep sea headlamp. Oh, well, of course I have one of those in my safe storage, but I can't give it to you for free. There's a condition. Please find my Leah's Chan figurine. It's a pink delivery box. Oh, I know where that is. You'll know it when you see it. I requested special care for the package, so it should not have been washed away. If the ship carrying it sank, it's likely to be somewhere nearby. Find it for me, and I'll give you the deep sea headlamp. I'll first have to find the location of the sunken transport ship. I saw that box earlier. Let's go. Da -da -da -da. Oh, I should have actually equipped the hush gun. Never mind, I'll get it after. I hear loud noises from over there. I should go check things out. <gasps> no! Leave them alone! Hey, why do you keep bothering these dolphins? So you're the one that keeps interrupting our plans. I can tell just by your silhouette. You need to be taught a lesson. You better be ready. Am I dead? I was just looking to scare them. I'll have to see if I can defeat them. <laughs> Uh-oh, hold on. Treating for the day. You'll hear from us again. Rusty dolphin necklace. It left something like an old charm. I should identify it later. Ooh, nice. I wonder what it does. Don't slap me. Do you think I can hit him after he does that? Eh. No, there's no way.
Okay, I hope this is a tranquilizer gun of some kind. Nope. It's a violence harpoon. What? Where was this guy's anime figurine? Was it further down to the left? Should I have gone left first? Precious Leah's Chan, bring it to me quick, finish your mission. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, but but he also wants the anime girl. Um What was that just now? My my Leah's Chan! She disappeared into the unfathomable depths. It seems to have been some kind of giant life form. Please go and retrieve her. Wait, that obviously looks dangerous. Besides, the doors on the ship are all locked, so I can't go inside. Do you really think I didn't think of that before concocting Leia's Chan's rescue plan? Yeah. I'll provide you with my secret weapon, the gas cutter. Even at this moment, Leia's Chan awaits her master. Come to the boat, will you? <laughs> okay, dude. Big fish yet? I could try. Hey, buddy. Coward! shark, but they're not that big compared to a person. <laughs> Mm. 
Can you go? I'm still having trouble calming down, just like Leah's chan did when she came face to face with Fenrir. Mm -hmm. Since you found the location, I'll reward you for it. I like to do honest dealings. Yay. Mm -hmm. Now let's begin the Leah's chan rescue can mission. Take this gas cutter. Mm -hmm. You'll see a spot that you can that can be cut into when you reach the ship. That will be a button prompt. Cut the weak point in the iron door and you'll be able to enter the ship. Mm -hmm. Just retrieve the pink delivery box that has Leah Chen from inside the ship. Should be simpler than you think. Mm -hmm. But I saw a huge tentacle taking the ship. That looks extremely dangerous. Do you mean to say that it's okay for Leah's chan to expire in the darkness down there? The mission must not be delayed for a moment longer. <laughs> uh, all right, I get it. Oh, well, I'm going to try going down there. Some uh, VTubers have figurines of themselves for sale, yeah. That's very impressive. I'm happy for you. <laughs> Increases dash speed by 30. Oh, that's hot. What's an eco health bracelet? Reduces damage taken by 10%. I see, I see. There. No treat! What the heck? Hello, my dirt. You need a brush, you dirty puppy. No. Filthy, filthy puppy. Night, Hedo. Sleep well. Olive oil. Radiation is that thing that makes fish taste better, right? Emotes? Uh, exclamation mark emotes for all the information. You can hit like a. Ow, come on. A shark with a trank dart? So that you uh, can get the best quality meat from them. Night, Yuki, sleep wonderfully. Uh, I think so, Dave Cap, yeah. Check in on something I'm supposed to be doing. Okay. 
Yep, just banning you real quick. Don't worry about it. No, give me that. I want that. Help! 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 I didn't want to be down in this cave. I don't know why it's here. I guess that's the whole thing about like the changeable nature of it or whatever. Let's try hang left. Oh yeah, no, I can't hang left, so I guess I have to go through here. Damn, I'm fast now. Fast as fuck, boy. Ow, fuck! <laughs> Inyin, why are you making weird noises? Okay. You okay? Okay. This must be the door. Let's try using a ga the gas cutter from Duff. Oh, what? Oh, God. Okay, hold on a second. I just, I just gotta check in on something. Okay. Turn on the cutter and use L to move. Keep your movements inside the circle. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I was in too much of a hurry to properly tell you how to use it, but you figured it out. Go through the open door now. Leah's Chan, your master is coming. You sense a dangerous creature's presence under... Ooh, I need more bullets. <laughs> Hold on. Give me a minute. I need to find bullets. Or this, this would work too, if it's a good gun. Mm. That's gonna have more bullets in it, so we'll do that. Place, the space below seems larger than expected. Take a look around, Dave. I'm gonna die. Oh, and there were bullets right here. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Ooh. Hope it's level one. I think this gives me more damage overall. anything bad when video games give you a bunch of stuff. Oh lord! There it is, the pink delivery box with Leah's chat inside! Wait, more importantly, look at that giant squid! So that's our culprit. I guess it knows a good thing when it sees it, even if it's just a squid. It seems to be asleep. Sneak up and bring it back quietly. I've come too far to go back empty-handed. I guess I'll try approaching quietly. Well, that didn't seem to be very quiet. <laughs> Giant squid! Ah! It's awake! I need to get back! Dave, don't tell me you're gonna chicken out! Use the gun I gave you! The harpoon will be of no use! Liz Chan, here we come! Ah! Oh my lord! Get fucked. Boop. The squid anchors. I'm 
gonna grab whatever this thing is down here. Maybe it will be more portable oxygen. Oh, that works too. What? Bullshit. Okay. First try. Took less shark uh, hits than the shark. Oh, hello. Were those sea people just now? What do you mean? All I can see is the pink delivery box. Bring it back quickly, it's awaiting rescue. Telling him won't do any good, I'll have to go up and tell Dr. Bacon. The box is pinned under a squid tentacle, I'll have to cut it anyway. I wonder if it's edible, I should t try taking it to Bancho. Yummy. That's the one, come back up to the boat. I'm so relieved, Leah's Chen. Yes, Lee's Chan, Lee's Chan! To think she hasn't been damaged. Oh, there's salt water everywhere. I'll clean you up. Here comes Leah's. Oops, I said Leah's Chan's lying by accident, even though I'm the master. <laughs> In any case, a promise is a promise. Here you are, the deep sea headlamp. It's a recent model that turns on automatically as necessary. I must go help Leah's Chan recover. Goodbye, eternity. <laughs> He's gonna lick that figure clean. You could have just not said that. Ew, I guess that's over for now. Come to think of it, I did bring this. What will I do with this giant squid tentacle? It smells so awful. I'm not sure I can be used to cook with. I'll have to give Banjo a call. What is it, Dave? I was helping Duff and I defeated a giant squid. <laughs> That's incredible. I couldn't bring the whole thing, so I cut off a bit of its tentacle. Is this edible, perhaps? Hmm, of course. The ammonium chloride that helps it float gives it an awful stench, however. And because it's very tough, it's difficult to cook using conventional methods. I don't think we'll be able to offer it to our customers anyway. Why don't we close up shop for a day and hold a party with the squid? I've been so busy since like, we opened that I haven't treated you to any proper food despite your hard work. <laughs> wow, that sounds fantastic. Let me clean up a bit, come to the sushi bar when you're ready. Dr. Bacon will be there as well, so I can tell him about the fish people I saw. <laughs> Dave, you're a bit late. Everyone's been waiting for you. Wow, you finished all the cooking already. Mm. How did how did he get the cooking done before I gave him the squid? When did everyone arrive, though? <laughs> a party with customers has been a lot of progress. Very good. As they? Restaurants should put their customers first. Food, drink, service, and customers are the basic foundations of a restaurant. In the past, there was only the rigorous chef and his cooking. Um, I was also here from the beginning. Yes, but you weren't very noticeable. <laughs> Do you remember what he told you back then about the reviews on Cooksta? You said there wasn't any real mention of me. But now people do mention you, albeit rarely. They say things like, he poured me hot green tea. He was working hard preparing the wasabi. He was friendly. He looked busy. Oh? The customers are recognizing your hard work. Well, that makes me feel good. Customers are honest and intuitive, more so than you think. They'll know if you're sincere, kind, diligent, or skilled, and they react accordingly. That's why I find this moment hard to believe. To think that the obstinate Bancho is working with people on holding parties. I think it's thanks to you, Dave. That makes me wonder what he was like in the past. I can't divulge details about someone else's past. But maybe someday, if the opportunity presents itself, I might be able to tell you. Dave, congratulations. Word of Banjo Sushi is now getting around. He looks to be in a very good mood. Look at this squid tentacle. It's the sort of thing you dream about eating as a child. I bet more people will flock here. Such things are offered on the menu. Aren't we eating this because it's difficult to serve to customers, though? Ugh, you're right. What a pity. Everyone will want to try something that looks like this, regardless of the flavor. Regardless of the flavor, you say? There's no way that Banjo could stomach that. Let's go with something else. 
All right, about the depths. I have feelings there must be things down there. Things that'll make people jump out of their seats. If Dr. Bacon's research is successful, the place will be famous and filled with people. Hmm, you're right. When that happens, we'll make tons of money! So let's keep at it, Dave. Let's get rich together. Uh, Dr. Bacon? Oh, Dave, what is it? I saw sea people down below. You what? <laughs> you really saw sea people and not dugongs. What did they look like? How, were they dressed? Did they resemble humans? Mm. Uh, their torsos look like ours, but the sight of me scared them off into the depths. I couldn't get a good look. Uh, That's too bad. It could have been an amazing uh, find. That means we might encounter them in the depths. That's where the signal is strongest. Uh, Perhaps there's even a village. Uh, a village? Uh, yes, they have artifacts, murals, a language. They are, they are beings with a unique civilization. Uh, yeah, yeah. It would not be surprising in the least for them to have live together in a village of sorts. Uh, that would be quite the find indeed. An ancient civilization under the sea could be revealed to us. Dave, you're my only hope. Keep up the good work. A giant squid tentacle. It really is an ingredient that's difficult to handle. Suppressing the stench that allow me to reach its essence. You're still studying the ingredients. Good work today, bringing back precious ingredients. This is a difficult sort to prepare, but it's that's the fun of cooking. How does it taste? The food's always been great, but today's is even more. Spectacular! Since there was a lot of it, I made many different dishes, though we won't be able to offer these to customers. It, there seems to be no end to the path of a chef. It's a fortunate thing to have a path to pursue. The same can be said of the study of ingredients. Please, Dave, please keep preserving and one, persevering, and one day we'll succeed. I'm not sure what you mean, but I'll be sure to bring back more fish. Pick up beer. That's good stuff. Bancho's food is so nice, I can understand the growing popularity of the restaurant. Or maybe it's because I caught the fish? In any case, there's been a lot of stuff going on. A giant squid, sea people. Am I a master sushi chef? Yes, of course! There's no end to the mysteries of the ocean, even if it's dangerous. I suppose I'll go even deeper tomorrow. I wonder what I'll find. Eh, whatever. I'll think about that tomorrow. Time to toast with everyone and rest. It's not cannibalism to eat sea people. What do you mean? <gasps> uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Hackerling, thank you for the 22 bucks. Welcome back. Hackerling, I'm gonna get shot for killing a squid. <laughs> Welcome, Hackerling. Good morning. I must have drank too much yesterday. I feel sick. You did seem a bit excited. You don't get gatherings like that every day. That sort of occasion calls for joviality. <laughs> you can't throw up here, doc uh, Dr. Bacon. I'm not the drinker I used to be. In any case, take the deep sea headlamp Duff gave you and try venturing down to the depths. It'll probably turn on automatically when you reach the right depth. And don't forget, you have to enhance your diving suit if you want to venture down there. I'll enhance my equipment first. By the way, do you happen to have scuba? <laughs> Ew. He's asking me to enter the water after that? Mm -hmm. I actually... Oh, here we go. I need to finish there, unfortunately, because I am due over in Crab Game. So I'm finishing a little bit early today, but I hope you guys enjoyed the game because I think you'll be seeing more of it as that was, like, horrendously addictive. Like, it's one of those games where I finish streaming and I'm like, you know what, I could actually really do with just playing more of that. <laughs> So, yeah, no, that was really, really fun. Yeah, I'm going to be playing a uh, crab game over with Chibidoki, I think, if everything goes well. So if you if you would like more Lime Malicious, you can catch me over over there. I'm sure that I won't be absolutely horrific at the game. That's a lie. I will be. I'm really bad at crab game. But I'm going to grab something to eat beforehand, hopefully, and then uh, jump in on there. So thank you so much. Oh, Evil Crash, thank you for the 88 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, no, thank you so much for watching. I had a really good time. I'll be back again tomorrow. And also, you know, in like half an hour when I'm on the on the crab game thing. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. If you would like information on when I'm next live. Oh, goodness. Thank you for the two months. Welcome back. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed. If you want information on when I'm live, please either follow the channel or check out my socials. If you